Hey Giants fans, Ryan Dunleavy, the beat reporter for NJ Advanced Media. And I'm going to give you three reasons to keep watching the Giants in the second half. I know you're all tweeting at me that you're done watching them. I don't believe you. Here's why you should stick with it. Number one, there's a lot of young players playing for this team. A lot of undrafted rookies playing for this team. Guys you should get to know for the future. Sean Chandler, Grant Haley playing a lot as defensive backs. Uh, Kyle Laletta is probably going to play quarterback at some point in the second half of this uh, season. You're going to have some young offensive linemen. You'll probably see Evan Brown. You'll probably see Cameron Moore in the defensive backfield. And that's besides all the guys who have been playing all along. The Lorenzo Carter, B.J. Hill, Saquon Barkley, Will Hernandez, the four promising rookie draft picks. You're going to see a lot of youth injected into this team. Uh, the Giants are going to keep flipping over the roster keep bringing in young players so that you're going to get to know a new Giants team. They're not just going to stay pat. The number two reason is there's a lot of winnable games on the schedule. You and I can debate right now if it's good that the Giants win games. They might be better off going 1-15 and or 2-14 and and getting a higher draft pick, but good luck selling that to anybody in the Giants locker room. This team, for all the negatives right now, they're still giving an effort. And the effort's going to lead to them winning some games against this schedule that includes the 49ers, the Colts, the Titans. They're going to win a game, two games, three games, probably get to a three, four win team. I know that's not what anybody wants, but they're going to win some games. They've been too close not to win games against the inferior competition coming up. And then the number three reason is the Eli Manning farewell tour. Eli Manning's a two-time Super Bowl MVP, one of the classy F classiest athletes to play here he deserves a good goodbye he's only two games over 500 for his career I doubt the Giants will let him start three more games at this point uh, so he's gonna start one more game two more games will his last start be at home in front of the home crowd I think that would be a nice way to handle it they obviously botched it last year so how is Manning treated in his last couple home game his last couple games for the Giants or did we already see it well, Eli Manning's goodbye really be like a wave from the sideline. I would hate to see that. I hope they at least trot him back out there onto the field one more time in front of the home crowd. So those are three reasons to keep watching the Giants as we enter the final eight games of the season. But thankfully, a bye is next.